Okay, I am leaving it. I'm leaving the hospital. We're gonna go to the tour thing. However, I thought that I could do it with like a thin long sleeve underneath this. I keep forgetting I'm not built for this. I'm not gonna lie, man. I'll show, I'll show y'all this path that it wants to take me on. I was kind of like, bro, what? You taking me just to the back back? Like I'm trying to go down the normal street or whatever, but <laughs> adventure, so. <laughs> take me all around the city this is what the bus looks like like oh and by the way conveniently enough look look at that the cable cars are right there and where I stay right there up on that hill so it wasn't that far but you know Second tour I ever gave for six women who graduated high school in 67. We're here for the summer of love. They showed up with a bag of brownies. They got the memo. Are we gonna do the PG tour today? Or did you pack your big girl panties for coming to San Francisco? <laughs> <laughs> six foot tall nude model who marries this old rich guy. To the hill was one. I'll, I'll tell you completely. Out of wood and burlap paper mache. And good luck kitties. Okay, so this is the first stop on the tour. Uh, we're on the Presidio, which he said was an old, uh, was a fort that planned Vietnam and the Spanish-American War and all that other type of stuff. So this is the first stop. I don't know where specifically we're at right now, but I know this is all torn down stuff. And then uh, straight ahead, I'll show y'all in a second. You'll, it's a dope view, just hold up. Hey yo, it's windy as hell though. I ain't even gonna I ain't gonna hold y'all. No cap. It was cool. There was a lot of things that I did not know. Like there's this one lady named Alma. That's the reason that sugar daddy is even a thing. So like. Okay. Okay. Who? Shit. I just got. So it was like she had to be a nude model to try and go into college. Who would want? Would rather want an old guy? Or an older guy trying to be her man versus like being lusted after by a, young, a bunch of younger guys. So this one dude was trying to holler at her for years and years and years, and then he finally, uh, they finally got together. And in an interview, they uh, asked her what like nickname for him. Oh, and she said, "I would call him my sugar daddy," which is where the term comes from. Crazy. Okay, so... Okay, so... So, I'm gonna take, like, a nap. These are great <laughs> for hostels because thankfully I can actually put the thing down and it can be darker, but you know what? Go to sleep and I do not care. Men, we can wear these too. They change your life. And then, uh, earbud things to put in your ear to silence stuff because folks be snoring loud be loud car alarm playing like some trap 
at like 5 a.m. But anyway, yeah, I'm finna go to sleep.